God. Are you okay? How have you, how have you been? What's going I, on? You know, honestly? Yes. I'm um, just great. <laughs> yeah. Look at me. Can you feel the honesty in that? Yeah. You seem bitter, angry. What's been going on? Uh, jeez. You all right? <laughs> the, um, I'm projecting on what's you. What's going on? Where have I been? I was in San Francisco for a little mm -hmm. while. I like San Francisco. Yeah, yeah, you're from the... Very gay, San Francisco. <laughs> Very gay. Really? You think so? I've, yeah, a little bit. Um, yeah. No problem. I have no problems with gay people. Actually, when gay men look at me, very flattered by it. You know, I have that moment where I say, that's right, take it in, baby. You know what I mean? <laughs> and they're like... You actually say they, that. They, 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 yeah, sure I do. And then yeah. it happens two times, and it's sort of like, all right, I get it. Just, you know, hang out. Just relax, will you? Right. And then by the third time, I'm like, am I gay? I think I'm gay. Am I? You know? <laughs> And that's awkward. I don't want to be gay. Not at this point. Really? What if I had to turn gay now? Then I have to get new clothes, you know, change the decor of my house, shoes, everything's different. Would all Friends change. have to go. I'd have to like uh, Elton John, which I don't. You know, there's a lot of things that would have to happen. There'd be what? no requirement. Do you like him? I do. You know, now I'm not, it's done. weird. I'm not homophobic, but I find him creepy. Well, you know. Okay. No, no one's better at taking the temperature of a crowd and reacting than you, Mark. Now... <laughs> You know, How can I alienate people, them immediately? You know, it's like, isn't it enough that... <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just trying to connect with people. You yeah, know what I mean? Be no, what better way to do that? Uh, <laughs> Let me try again. I don't care what you think. <laughs> Good. Now you've got him. Yeah, look at that. They're now you've got my him. Hand, You're dude. Mr. Nice. Yeah. Now, you know, you talk about you don't want to change. You've been coming on this show for eight years. And you're always talking about how you're not going to become, you, you're not going to become, what are you doing down there? I, oh. I just realized right. I have my cell phone. Yeah, this is, is I, the point. You've been saying for years you're not going to use a cell phone. Isn't it and weird like that I have it with me? Isn't that ridiculous? It's insane, yeah. I wasn't even going to get one of these because I thought they looked stupid. I thought they looked ridiculous. But then so many people look stupid. I'm like, I got to look stupid. I got to be part of this, you know? And I, I have it, and if I don't have it now, I panic. I'm like, oh my God, the satellite doesn't know where I am. You, you know what I mean? I'm an unidentified human object floating freely throughout the global information grid. What if people I don't want to talk to need to get hold of me now, you know? And, and like, I try to be polite. Look at they're laughing, Conan. I try to be polite. It's like, not a good sign when a comedian is stunned by an audience laughing. <laughs> You're like, huh? Oh, what's that? Oh, laughter. You know, you are so lucky <laughs> that I like you. All right. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. kidding. Man. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. I love you, too. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, like, I try to be polite with this. I'll, like, I'll, if I'm in a crowded place, I'll put it on vibrate. You know, but I don't know what's more awkward, a phone ringing or me going, ah! You know, because I, <laughs> I can't adjust to the vibration without first thinking I have MS or a tumor or something. Right, right. And now, see the one guy who laughed really loud? Yeah. You hear? yeah. He's right. He's the correct guy. That's and good. all 150 other people, whenever that happens it's in the crowd... It's actually a lot more. Listen to this. It's I, actually know, about 208. I was going to do... All right, 208. So one guy goes, ah, ha, ha, and like everyone else goes, what the hell's wrong with that guy? You know? And that's actually, oddly, how religions get started. Now, okay, so... <laughs> All right, can I get... Yeah, right, so we're back to the phone, yeah, all right? Yeah, So now, um, I got a pretty good deal. It's like 900 a month. Um, it's... That's good for an apartment, it's, yeah. No, it's, it's, well, it's like 200, but if I go two calls over, they're like 350 a call. I don't know, it's a lot of paperwork, you know? Right, right. And I have, uh, on my phone, I have Bach... Uh, Wagner, Beethoven, great really? classical pieces of music, little snippets, but I don't really know what they're for. I think it's sort of weird and wrong because, I mean, what are they for? Have you ever heard it? Like, if we were in this crowded place right now, up in the crowd, and you were to hear, pa 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 pa, would you actually go, hmm, that's wonderful, little Beethoven, good choice. <laughs> Thanks for sharing that. We're going to enjoy the show, but thank you for sharing that. And do you think Beethoven had any idea when he was deaf and sweating over his Fifth Symphony that one day would emit from some idiot's pocket, you know, and the response would be, damn, it's my mom, you know? <laughs> I don't think so, no. It's just, you know, but this is what we have. This is all we have, Conan. Yeah. This, this is the future. Here it is. This is it. Woo! You, you know? Well, you're, you're not satisfied it. with that? No, what we get? We get cell phones and computers. What happened to the future where I get a jet pack? Where's that future? <laughs> when, I was a, when I was a kid, they said we were going to get a flying car. Right, flying cars. Where's this, the future where I push a button, I vaporize, go to France for lunch? What happened to that one? Right, right. This is it. This is what we get. We get a computer. We get, right, fellas? All the band is like, oh, we had those in the 60s. Right, um, right. But the... <laughs> the band often goes to France in their oh. mind, yeah. <laughs> That guy, he goes right from trombone to cowbell. That's rain. <laughs> that is rain. Not even missing a beat. Ba, yeah. beep, ba, ping, ping, ping. Equally as... Yeah, and he gets anyways. extra for that, yeah. 
Here, we're talking about the future. Oh, sorry. We? Yeah, we were talking. That was your I, I have some complaints. You're disappointed that this is the future? Yes, that was the riff. But the thing is, because this is all we get. We get this, we get computers, and oh yeah, scooters. We get scooters. That's right. a big plus. When did it become okay to see a grown person on a scooter? <laughs> and, and... True. You know, and not just say, hey, what, what's wrong with you? You know, right, what do you right. mean, what do I mean? You're on a scooter. It's for children. <laughs> you know, I don't care if you got the little carrying case. It's a scooter. <laughs> You know, but I yeah. think that this is all part of the progressive infantilization of the grown-up mind. You see, hear me out here, buddy. They want us all to think like adolescents, so we, you know, buy things we don't need and we don't care about anything. It happened like, you know, it happened like um, five years ago, I think, when the first grown-up turned his baseball hat backwards and no one stopped it, you know? <laughs> all right. Yeah. And then, and then out of nowhere, hey, Adam Sandler's got a career, you know? All right? And then... Why don't, you, on, why don't you pick someone more popular than I, Adam Sandler or Elton John? It's not, it's, not about, it's not about Adam Sandler. I like Adam Sandler. I'm just saying that, no, but he's not infantile. All right, now, I think, like, that's some, uh, hello, I'm sorry, did I not, did I, the cat's out of the bag now? What, what I'm saying, what I'm saying, what's going to happen next year? I Is think, there a suicide note I in your room right there. now? If we went back there now, would it say I'm ending it tonight next on the year, air? it's just going to be grown-ups and diapers. You watch. <laughs> They're going to be in diapers on their scooters with their hats turned backwards. Very nice. And their cell phones blaring Wagner's Flight of the Valkyries. You've won them over. Mark is going to be at Caroline's Comedy Club in New York City Wednesday, February 28th. Nobody brings them so low but then gets them so high. Then yeah. Mark Merritt will be right